Let's talk about AI and five ways that we can use it to supersize our business. And I'm going to contend right up front here that if we're not embracing and utilizing AI, we are going to find ourselves at a distinct competitive disadvantage in the not too distant future. I started using AI for just playing with it about a little over a year ago now. And I resisted because I'm not necessarily an early adopter of technology and different tech. Uh, took me how many decades to get on the internet and online. So I'm not sure I'm, I'm maybe the best person to talk about this, but based on my past experience, I think I have some insights in this area. I want to talk about five areas just briefly today because it's such a huge topic that we want to consider in five ways that AI is already impacting us. I wanted to say will impact us, but it's already impacting us depending on what industry and what type of business that you're in. Number one, we'll talk about AI integration. Number two, enhancing customer engagement. Number three, optimizing decision making. Number four, driving um, innovative and creative solutions to problems. And then five, ensuring that we have a competitive advantage. Because our competition, people that we consider our competition, or even people we don't consider our competition, are already embracing and using AI for the things we're going to talk about quickly. Number one, AI integration. What does that mean? It means that we are using it to streamline our workflows, streamline our processes, and automate our processes and procedures where appropriate, which means less resources need to be allocated to certain tasks within our organization, and they can be reallocated to areas that will give us a better use of those resources. And it'll help us identify bottlenecks. I don't know about you, but usually bottlenecks are something it took us a while to find or figure out based on negative feedback or negative experiences of our customers or our internal customers. And then we would realize where the bottleneck was and fix it. Now with artificial intelligence, there's so much data analysis capability and process analysis capability. It can find those bottlenecks before they become a problem to our end user or to our customers. <clears throat> It'll help us, again, optimize resource allocation, predict trends and what's important to the people that we're here to serve. It'll help us streamline workflows, I think I already said that, and increase productivity in a lot of different areas across our organization. It'll help us to enhance customer engagement. Well, how does it do that? It helps us by giving us information, more information than we ever dreamt possible about our customers or our ideal future customers by predicting uh, patterns, trends, behaviors that based on past data, uh, the people that are most likely to do business with us, things like that. It'll help us to, uh, with chatbots and other things, we can now give real-time support, which customer support is generally a huge expense for most organizations, but we can automate a lot of that and a lot of the most common problems and questions and provide great service to people via automation and chatbots. We can personalize product recommendations and tailor their actual experiences and tailor solutions specifically to certain customers or certain groups of customers. We can offer meaningful engagement and build long-term customer relationships via more conversations with them. And we can automate many of those processes. And then when a real human being is required, we get a real human being involved. <coughs> when it comes to optimizing decision-making, there's advanced analytics and advanced uh, information and data collation and collection available automatically through artificial intelligence that isn't available to us unless we spend a lot of time and energy uh, collecting and collating and analyzing that information. Now it can be done automatically, which reduces our risks, which uh, increases our ability to make decisions based on data. Data-based decisions are generally better than just we winging it in our organizations. Uh, artificial intelligence can be used to derive innovation and creativity. Why? Because it allows us to explore new territory that we've never explored before. We can cross research industries and we can apply, uh, you know, without having to do it ourselves because I've done that for decades. It takes a lot of time and energy, but artificial intelligence can do it in minutes what we used to spend months or years doing for analysis in research and development. And it'll come up with novel solutions based on a vast array of information that we never would have even had access to before. And finally, it ensures a competitive advantage. How? Well, if you can make better decisions, if you can streamline your 
uh, processes, if you can automate some of your workflows, if you can identify bottlenecks, if you can make database decisions, if you can serve people per, in a personalized way better, faster than others, that number one gives you a, a competitive advantage. And if we can come up with uh, different solutions and novel solutions to problems, that gives us a competitive advantage because we're not just like everyone else in our field or in our industry. It helps us to captivate our audiences, give them disruptive solutions or what feels like disruptive new vehicle solutions to them because they've never experienced them before. And sometimes that's all our, we need and all our customers need to have a competitive advantage. So love to know, are you using artificial intelligence in any way, shape or form to build and grow and supersize your business right now? Like I said, I am just at the beginning of using it, but I realized by by researching this topic today a little bit more, that I better get my rearing gear and get on it if I want to stay relevant in today's economy. That's it. Have an awesome day, and I'll, of course, be with you tomorrow. Happy Leap Year, by the way, uh, with another topic and way to supersize and grow our businesses. Have an awesome day. Bye.